Now, part two of our special series, Mobile by Air. Over the past decade, our city has seen a lot of new industry and development. Tonight, News 5's Bill Riles shows you the footprint of one of the biggest economic drivers in Mobile, and now one of the nation's largest shipbuilders, Austell USA. It's only from the air that you can get a full grasp of how big Austell USA really is, how it dominates the city in sheer size, acreage, number of employees, and economic importance. Its mobile footprint is massive, taking up more than 100 acres. It's here where Alabamians build two kinds of innovative and futuristic aluminum ships. On a basic level, take a look at the parking lots. Right now, just a little over 4,000 people work here with Austell at full employment. We counted the cars, 870 cars on the side lot, and about 1,250 in the back lot. There are still a few empty spaces. Now, what's that giant white building? It's called the Module Manufacturing Facility, and that's where all of the aluminum for the ships is offloaded from semis, and the first building blocks of the warships are created from scratch. Inside these walls, massive sheets of aluminum are cut, bent, shaped, and connected. Those large components are then moved a short distance away to these buildings on the Mobile River. They are the final assembly bays, and there are four of them. And this is where thousands of components are turned into ships that cost more than a half billion dollars each. Floating there in front are two littoral combat ships, the USS Gabriel Giffords on the left and the USS Montgomery on the right. Last year, the company acquired more riverfront property and dredged out what's basically the biggest boat dock along the Mobile River at a cost of about $40 million. Up to four nearly finished vessels can be moored here. It keeps the new vessels out of river traffic and helps keep Austell moving forward as the city's largest industrial employer. Reporting from high above the Mobile River, Bill Riles, News 5.